Hey, welcome back to GT Canada. You've had your PlayStation 5. You wanna make sure that everything is running correctly and that you're getting the best possible performance. Well, I have a tip for you that you may have missed, and that's because when you first set up your PlayStation, it said, do you want visual or do you want performance? Now you probably said, well, this is a PlayStation, I want visual. And what that does is it'll drop your frame rates to make each frame look prettier. But if you're playing a first person shooter like Warzone, for example, or the new Cold War, you might want to go for a higher frame rate. And that just allows you to get an advantage over your competitors and you want to get the highest frame rate possible. So I'm going to show you exactly how to set up your PlayStation 5 for a higher frame rate at possibly the expense of visual quality. So the first thing you want to do is go to the screen and video settings. And when you get into there, you're looking for the first option, which is video output. When you get into video output, you want to double check that the resolution is set to automatic. It's possible that your PlayStation has locked on to 4K or is locked on to 1080, depending on the monitor or the TV that you're connected to. Where that could become a problem is if the game supports 4K, it'll just run 4K. If the game supports only 1080, it'll try to upscale it to 4K at the expense of frame rate but we want to tell it we want better frame rates. So once we've set this to automatic, we can go to the next step. And the next step would be to go to the saved data and game slash app settings option. So that's two down from where we just were. Once you get into there, what you're gonna find is, you're gonna find an option called game presets. In game presets is where you're going to be picking your performance mode versus your visual mode. What you want to do is click on the second option, performance mode or resolution mode. And we want to click that and pick performance mode. You probably picked resolution mode, at least I know I did. That was great, but now I'm ready for a little bit of a boost in frames per second and some performance. So click performance mode and that's it, you're done. Now what you can do, reboot your PlayStation and then load your favorite title. Your TV might switch resolutions now. So if your TV or your monitor supports say 4K at 60 Hertz, but it'll support 1080 at 120 Hertz, it might switch to 1080 to give you that bump in frame rate at the sacrifice of visual, which is okay because the, the frames per second is what we're after in this example here. So that's really it though. That's all it takes to make your PlayStation 5 perform in performance mode, even if you had selected visual mode when you first set it up. So I hope this video helped you out. Don't forget to check out some of our other tips and tricks, which can be seen right here. If you haven't subscribed already, you can do that below. Until next time though, have a great day.